Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is Airdrop Crates. Da -da -da. This is for the month of September 2018, and I believe this month's actual theme is Adventure Crate? I think that's what it is, so we're gonna get right on into this. It's actually decently heavy, so I, I don't know what could be in it. Let's get into it, and let's see what is up. Before we get into this unboxing, if you are interested in picking up an airdrop crate, make sure you use code SPEEDY to save 10% on your order. So let's get right on into airdrop crates. Da -na -na. Super excited for this crate. I always like getting airdrop crates because it's always something really different. It's a gaming subscription box for anybody who does not know. And that's, that's it. That is it. Let's see what is in the box. Ooh, okay. First off, we have the letter that says, thank you. So thank you, dear valued customer. Thank you for purchasing with Airdrop Crates and welcome to the family. We value you and forever grateful for your support. Sincerely, Airdrop Crates. Nice. I always like getting a letter because it kind of makes me feel good inside that they actually appreciate me getting airdrop crates. <laughs> so let's get into the unboxing. I like how they do the sticker too. It is just so, so cool. I like the paper this month too. It's a nice blue. Looks really good with the white. Oh, it looks really, really nice. Ooh. So first thing we have in the box is going to be, I see something really big too. It looks like a shirt. Maybe it could be a shirt. I'm not sure at the moment, but we have a couple of these mixed energy Nice energy drink powders, which is really nice. I like getting these because last month they actually gave a shaker cup. So now I can put these in the shaker cup and taste some rainbow candy flavor. What? That's a flavor? Oh, that is that is really cool. Two rainbow candy flavors. That's actually really interesting. I like very sweet kind of uh, energy drinks. So that will definitely be awesome to test out and try. Now feel the energy. I actually like those. So two of these, which is pretty cool. I like those a lot, actually. Next, there's going to be whatever this is. Looks like it's a pin. Ooh, we have a pin. What is it? Ooh, what? It's from Fallout. Oh, what? Okay, not expecting that. I thought it was going to be a uh, airdrop crates pin like they did the other month. No way. If I can get this open. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's a little uh, pit boy kind of guy. I don't know his name. That is such a cool pin. Look at that. Like what? Oh, that is super duper detailed too. He's like, hey, yeah, you. Oh, that is that is a really cool. If you guys don't know, I like collecting pins, so that is definitely a really cool pin to add to the collection. I don't think I even have a Fallout pin, so cool Fallout pin, really awesome. Let's see what else we have. This it's a keychain for sure. It's metal too. It's really heavy. This is interesting. I don't even know how to open it. Come on, open, open sesame. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's super shiny. Ooh, look at that shine though. Oh, that looks really good. It's a golden sword. I'm not too sure what game this is supposed to be from. I'm just not too sure which one at the moment. But I mean, it is all metal. This is all metal, which is really cool. And it's a really cool looking keychain. I really do like that. Don't know if I'm gonna put it on my key ring or not for my keys for my house or anything, but I think this is something cool to hang up in like a gaming room or just hang it up anywhere. Maybe on a lanyard? That is actually a very detailed... That is a super detailed... Sword. And it's also kind of pointy. <laughs> so it's, actually, it's not sharp or anything. It's really, it's not sharp because it's a keychain. But it's still, it's like, wow, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like that. That is pretty cool. Maybe I could use this to open up the little packs of uh, energy mix. What is this? Oh, Mass Effect. N7. What is this? A, is this a sticker? No, it's a patch or a... Uh, yeah, it's like a patch. Yeah, you put on like a jacket and you sew it into the jacket. Oh, an N7 Mass Effect logo. That is nice. That is really cool. Really game related stuff this month. I really like this month's box because it's definitely, it has a lot of different stuff. Like last month's box had like, it was really good as well. Don't get me wrong. But this month it has like, there's Mass Effect, there's Fallout, there's whatever game this is from, there's Energy Mix, and then there's this, which looks like Zelda. I don't know if it is or not, but it looks like the Triforce. Ooh, there's even something else. What? I thought this was going to be the last item. What is this? That's definitely Zelda. That is 100% Zelda, which I'm a fan of this already. What is it? Is it a t-shirt? No, it's a string. It's a bag. It has to be a bag. Ooh, 
oh, oh, I'm super excited for this. Oh, oh, that sound. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't like that sound. <gasps> oh, that is a bag. That is a flipping bag. What? Look at that. That's super thick. Like, really thick material. Oh, I like this. Oh, I like this a lot. Look at that bag, though. Like, the back of it doesn't have anything on it, but the front, this is definitely a Zelda bag, 100%, though. Oh, my goodness. That is cool. Oh, it even feels really cool. What? It's like a really nice mesh material. It's not plastic or anything. It's like a mesh. Like, uh, it's kind of like... It's like a cotton, I guess. I'm not too sure. I'm not good with fabrics, but it's actually a very thick material. So you could definitely put a lot of stuff in this way and it wouldn't rip. This is a very thick, reliable material. I really like that. Oh man, freaking bag. That is such a cool thing. I didn't even know this was gonna, I thought it was gonna be a t-shirt. Oh, that is so cool. And then we still have one more item in the box, I think. Is it? No, there's still another one. We got the sticker. I forgot all about it. We have this sticker, and I think that's going to be it. Let's make sure nothing fell out. And that is it for the box. Oh, man. Airdrop crates, you guys are outdoing yourself. Let's see. We have the air... We, oh, okay, here we go. We have the adventure crate sticker. So I was right with adventure crate. Really nice. Okay, so adventure crate sticker. Really nice. By the way, next month's box is going to be the Call of Duty Black Ops 4 crate, which is going to be so cool. So it's going to be Call of Duty Black Ops 4 related items. So, so cool. I'm super psyched for that because currently I'm playing the Call of Duty 4 beta and it is so good, the blackout beta. And I'm just looking forward to the next crate. The next crate is going to be unbelievable. Now, is this another bag? No, I think it's a flag. It has little grommets. This is like a puzzle. I don't know what it is. I think it opens here. What is this? It's like Christmas morning. It really is. What's nice about airdrop crates is that it literally feels like Christmas every month. Like you are getting a box in the mail full of goodies that you don't know because it's a mystery. They just give you the hint of what the month's theme is and you get a mystery box sent to your house. It's like Christmas morning. Oh, it's so cool. It's definitely a flag. It's got the two grommets right here to put on like a flagpole or something. What is this? It's definitely like a lion. Some kind of, okay, that was a fail. Some kind of lion of some sort? I feel like I should know this. Is this, is this could, okay, this could just be like a generic lion. I'm not too sure. But it also could be from a video game, a TV show. I'm not sure on this one. It still looks really cool. It's definitely a flag because this is the end of it. It is, yeah, basically just like the one side. So it is definitely a flag. Or maybe it's one of those things that you hang down from like up above and it would hang like this. It could very well be one of those flags that literally you hang it from like a building like this and it would hang straight down, which I think looks really cool for like a castle or something. That is, that's actually really long too. It's like it's a super long flag. Look at that, super long. So all I know is that it's a lion and I'm not sure what it's actually from, but it's still really cool. I do like that. I. Don't really know of any flags I've ever gotten in a monthly subscription box before. So that is definitely a first and also the bag as well. These two items right here are definitely very unique to subscription boxes. I don't think I've ever seen a bag or a flag in a subscription box. So very unique to its own and I, I like that. I like the originality of it. So I'm gonna recap what was in airdrop crates for this month of September. And so far I'm just like, I'm really impressed with airdrop crates and they're doing a fantastic job with what's actually in the boxes. So this is the time that I let you guys know what I think each individual item is actually worth. And this is from coming from me, like what I think it's worth. I know they usually have prices online, what this stuff is worth and all that, but I don't care about that. It's, it's mainly what I think or what I would pay for these items. First thing is the flag. I think that's a really cool item because it's very unique to subscription boxes. And I would probably give this like a five to six dollar value probably six bucks the bag this on the other hand is super i like this is probably my favorite item in the box because i can use it first of all second of all it's stylish and third of all you can wear it so cool i mean i guess that goes with number one that i can use it but mm, i don't care and okay number three you can put stuff in it <laughs> i can put all the items inside even the flag <laughs> so definitely a cool item the zelda backpack little oh so cool i like this so so much this is definitely a nine to ten dollar value right here i would give it a ten dollar value easy because it's a backpack basically so a backpack ten dollars right there super cool the mixed energy these are about a dollar a pack so to say so i'll give two dollars for those 
use. The N7 patch, I'd probably give this uh, like a dollar to two dollars. It's probably, yeah, around there, dollar to dollar. The uh, sticker as well, it's not really worth anything to me, but I mean, maybe like 50 cents a dollar. Uh, also, there is the sword, which is a pretty cool keychain, probably like a three to five dollar value within there somewhere, probably like four bucks. It's kind of cool. It is all metal, so keep that in mind. Definitely a very cool keychain. And there's also the pin. The pin itself, pins usually go for like anywhere from like two to four dollars. Uh, this one is a very cool one since it is Fallout, it probably gives like a three dollar value. So I would probably give everything on the table a 25 to $30 value and I think that is definitely a very good value for the actual box because the box is $19.99 plus shipping and handling but you're paying for the mystery aspect of it and you're getting really cool stuff in the box as well that's all game related. So I think it's definitely cool and also there's different things that you would never think about trying before. So it opens up different doors to different opportunities for you, the things you might like in the future. So I think that is very cool. I really enjoyed this month's box. I hope everybody enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to give a fat smack on that like button. Also, I will leave all the airdrop crates unboxings in this corner. The most recommended video over here. Subscribe to the Speedy Diver. Oh yeah. And subscribe to the Speedy Gamer, my gaming channel. I seriously do like gaming and that's what all my channels are about gaming 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 and this crate is about gaming if you guys want to pick one of these up for yourself make sure you definitely use code speedy because that will save you 10 percent on your entire order and with that being said i'll catch all of you on the flip side